So here I am in Amy's closet. Hi, so I'm here in Catherine's closet. I have a really hard time describing my style and Amy will probably see this when she goes in my closet because I feel like it has a lot of different facets. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong, but I feel like I have like a more like sophisticated side and then I have like a more fun side or like colorful. I kind of just wear whatever matches my mood and I have many different moods. Yeah. So my style is a range. That's what I would say. It doesn't really, I don't know, maybe eclectic because there's a bunch of different things. My style is a lot of different things. It's like <laughs> boho, but then it's also kind of Very like, boho. Artsy. Yes, it's very artsy and it's also a lot of like vans and skater. You have a skater side. My style is makes me look a lot younger than I am. So I'm 27 and I'm 24. So I feel like there's also you can see the difference of like the earlier 20s yeah. and the later 20s. There's definitely yeah. a difference there in the styles. You're like knock, knock, knocking on 30. I'm knocking on 30. I'm so excited to be 30. Oh my gosh. I think my biggest challenge, all the tall girls out there are gonna relate to this. You find something so cute and it literally is like so short that you're like, this is inappropriate. I can't wear this in public. And you are so sad and you wanna cry because you're like, I don't wanna dress like an old lady because that's where like most of the longer clothes are. You just don't wanna feel like you're like way older than you are. When I was younger, I just used to buy stuff when I was like a teenager or whatever. And I'd always be like, pulling things down and like now I'm just like I'm not buying something unless it fits. It's probably why I don't have a whole lot of clothes. Honestly it's the same exact thing but the opposite. Everything is either too long, not necessarily lengthwise, because usually like skirts and dresses are fine. The shoulder area is too long. We have the same problem because the average woman in America is five foot four and we're both like way off way that. Different so than that. We are, the clothing you find is not made for either of us. We're gonna be doing our own shoes because as you can see our foot size is a Very lot different. 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 Amy I'm, is a five. I'm a five, yeah. And I'm an eight. So there's no, no way we work. could wear each other's shoes. It's just not gonna work. So we're gonna be picking out three outfits from each other's closet, which is very hard because like three outfits, like maybe one would be like maybe one. chill, but like three is a lot of outfits. That's a lot. So we're picking out three outfits. One's gonna be a chill hang outfit. So like, you know, hanging with your girls on a Saturday afternoon, maybe. Um, another one is gonna be a Fancy or nice date night. And then the last one's gonna be GNO, aka okay, girls night out. Lisa is going to be the judge of this challenge and she's gonna choose who picks out better outfits. So let's go ladies and gentlemen. I'm feeling a little overwhelmed. There's just like a lot of clothing in such a small space and Hopefully I can find stuff that covers me because I don't like to be exposed to the world. It's not really my thing. I don't really know how this is gonna work, you know? There's like a foot between us basically, 11 inches to be exact. We're gonna, we're gonna try it. We're gonna see. I brought some shoes with a little bit of a heel just to, you know, kind of take the edge off. I know Amy has like a lot of, um, like crop tops, like this would literally be like a, almost like a sports bra on me. Like that's like, that's definitely not a shirt for me. I don't normally buy crop tops because they just look so short because I'm tall and they're made for like the average sized girl. But Amy loves them and they, I think they work on her because she is so little. So it's almost just like wearing a normal shirt. Like I don't know what this, where, how that works. Where am I? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Kat, that's such a different style than I do. It's more like, I would say it's more feminine and mature than mine is. Mine is like a mix of like feminine, but like also kind of like, like not, it's not really nice. Let's enter the land of the tall, shall we? This is honestly the first thing I see because I have eight denim jackets in my closet. I have to give one away anytime I want to buy a new one because I've reached my limit. So we're just gonna, we're gonna keep this because this is a really cute jacket. So we're gonna put this in this space. This is my space of maybes. Kat's sweater life is just way different than mine. A very long sweater, but I'm sure it's normal length on her. How? This is literally the tiniest little thing I've, like, look at that. I, no, it's not gonna work. Amy's so tiny, it's like a little doll's clothes. Like this shirt actually would be long enough. That actually looks like it would fit. Amy and I have different body types. So I don't know if this would look very good on me because I don't normally like to wear like V-neck tank tops. It makes my shoulders look broad in a weird way. Kat loves her like thin hooded sweaters. I love sleeves like this. I love this shirt. <laughs> it probably looks like kind of cropped on her in a way. For me, it's gonna be a regular long shirt. Okay, this is going in the maybes. This is really going in the maybes because I think I can make it work if I had like more fitted 
pants. Things you will never see in my closet besides the one black collared shirt that I have is collared shirts. She loves a good collar. Ooh, that's a cute pocket, Kathy. Oh, I freaking love this shirt. So our maybes is getting kind of kind of large, but you know, we gotta do what we gotta do in these streets, you know? This is the first thing I found that looks like it would actually fit on my body. Okay, that actually looks like it might fit. It might be a little funky, because I don't know if this is supposed to be a long sleeve or a three quarter, but that would, I don't know. I mean, that looks like it would fit me. I just don't think it would look that cute. Probably the hardest thing is gonna be the bottoms. Hey, I think this used to be mine. This is like a dress. How does she have this few t-shirts, guys? She's a minimalist, apparently I'm not. This is not, do you see this? This is her t-shirts. How is that a thing? Guys, if I tried to wear this, it would look like a joke. When did she get this? Me when I don't see the bottom. <laughs> Because that's what you do when you're tall in this world. You wear maxi dresses without a care. You reach things without a care or a second thought. You need no ladders. Oh my gosh, she probably just like daintily reaches up, barely doing anything, and just, oh, I'm just gonna put it very organized up there. Ugh, I'm jealous. I mean, it's a really cute dress, but I'm gonna tell you right now that would be like me wearing an oversized shirt. It's definitely not gonna work for my um, standards. What? What is this? This actually looks kind of long. How does Amy wear this? This actually would probably fit me. <laughs> what the heck? How does she wear this? I'm so confused. This is actually like really long. I like this. This could probably be like date night. I feel like I could totally wear that with Max like going on a date. Oh, this is cute. Oh my gosh. I feel like this might be too small for me. It's an extra small and I normally can wear like a small at the smallest. I'm gonna keep that. So maybe that could be like for my girls night out. This could be a fancy one because that looks pretty fancy. Where are the skirts? Ooh, this is a cute dress. I'm so short though. One of the biggest problems for me is that this area, whatever it's called, is way shorter than the average. So t-shirtish things don't hit right on me. That's what happens when you're three inches tall, lady. Oh, this is cute. But once again, this area, way too long. It's not gonna hit right in any way, shape, or form. When did she get all this new stuff? Or does she just not wear her clothing? I can't tell. Oh, but then see, look, these long, too long. I'm scared, guys. What am I gonna wear? I can hide behind this. <laughs> this is <laughs> I feel like Amy's pants are also gonna be too small because I think she has a smaller waist than I do. This is definitely gonna be the hardest part is the pants. Being tall for my entire life, I can just look at things like that would literally be like me wearing a loincloth. This is a child's mess. It's large 1416. I can't wear those. That's gonna be too small for me. Actually, that one might work. This is a six, I am a six, but how am I supposed to match it? Cause it's like a bright yellow. So then I'd actually have to find a shirt that would go with it. These actually look very roomy. These are a 14? 14 in children's or 14 in women's? I'm confused. There are 14 in women's, how does Amy wear that? Cause it's not her size. Maybe I could try those for like the casual outfit. I feel like I'm just gonna look like Amy. <laughs> Ooh, do I see adjustable straps? Yes, I do. That is my best friend is an adjustable strap. Cause like I can't wear stuff that doesn't have adjustable straps. Cause guys, every one of these dresses is gonna be mid calf to ankle. And that's not what it's supposed to look like, guys. What am I gonna do? I think with all the things that I found, I can put stuff together. I just need to find a shirt for like the comfy, cozy hang. Amy wears a lot of oversized sweaters that are, that are, that are very like big on her. So that, I feel like won't be that hard to find. See, this turtle looks cute, but I feel like it would be really short on me. <laughs> she's, she's probably gonna look at all my stuff and be like the jolly green giant. <laughs> this, do you see this? Do you see, this will drag and I have height on, AKA like two inches. I might be able to get away with this. No, I would not. I never look at the bottom, dang it. Oh, okay, 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 okay. This we can work with. I'm betting you like 20 bucks. She has to wear tights with this, but this will go to my basically knees. Oh, these. Yes, we'll go with these because that just would be really cute. That's a yes. That's a yes from me. It is going to Hollywood. So we have one outfit down. Whatever, we'll figure it out. We'll tank top it. We'll do whatever we need to do. Oh yeah, I'll just wear some pants. They're not supposed to go up to your rib cage, ladies. I feel like my best option would be some sort of skinny jean type of thing. Okay, I could do this. I think it might work. I'm not checking what size these are because guess what? It's not gonna matter in the, in the end. We're just gonna roll and we're gonna scrunch and we're gonna cover. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Sorry, Kath. What? 
Sorry, Catherine, for destroying your pile of pants. Oh, perfect. Okay, guys, we are done. We did it. All right, I'm gonna try things on and make sure that they actually fit. <laughs> Buongiorno, I am Lisa, and I am the judge today of this um, outfit competition, outfit swap, I don't know. I'm going to be judging the outfits based on general appeal. Does it look good or does it make me want to upchuck? I don't have high hopes. I don't think it's going to go well, but we'll see. The reason that I am judging this is because I am the most fashionable person in this family, no contest. The first outfit we're judging is Catherine's casual hangout outfit, and I'm covering my eyes so I don't ruin the surprise. Ready? Entree! Okay. Oh go. my gosh! I can't believe you even got her clothes on! I know, it's really hard. Oh my gosh, it's so crazy! I absolutely hate these jeans. I want to burn them in a fire. They're digging into me in all the wrong places. Wait, I always thought for some reason that all of Amy's shirts were like one inch long. They like, are. It's not like- She has a like... couple of their actual shirts, but most of her shirts are like crop tops that she just wears like a normal shirt. <laughs> are those your socks? Yes, these are my socks. Oh, that seems like cheating. I'm gonna have to dock a point for that. Oh, okay. Um, well, I like it. Wow, it looks pretty good. I kind of like this vibe on you. Are those your earrings? <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, no, we already decided that we were doing our own accessories. Because <sighs> the, the point is that you're fitting in the clothes that you I, I didn't approve you. this and I don't think it's right. It wasn't me do Amy style, it was me fitting her clothes. I give her a six and a half because she didn't use all of Amy's stuff, which I think is a little bit cheating. It looks pretty good on her. It looks pretty natural. Um, it looked like it fit well. Apparently the jeans were uncomfortable, but I couldn't tell. So six and a half to a seven, I don't know. Now we're gonna judge Amy's casual hangout. I'm trying not to look at it too early. Okay, okay, come in. Wait, those are Catherine's jeans? That's what I said to myself! Kat, do you wear like really short jeans? Look, What's it's going on? Been uncuffed. They're like. Wait, what? <laughs> hey, but if you notice, this is up to my like. Yeah, that's rib really cage. high. It looks pretty good. I like it. It is a different vibe for you. You both have like different vibes in these clothes, but it still like works. I know. Um. It's a little plain, but okay. Shoo shoo. <laughs> Catherine gets a seven, Amy gets a six and a half officially. So just a, cl a close, but Catherine won that one. One, two, three. Look at each other! Oh okay, those jeans actually are too short on me. I heard you guys talking together. Yeah, why do these fit they, so long? No, well? they don't actually, they're actually way too short on me and I just wear them with arms. I wanted you to choose that shirt. I wanted you, you to choose did. it. It's so cute on you. I knew yeah. it would look good. You look, it's really weird because you're like skatery, but you're also kind of sophisticated with the shirt. I know. But it, I like it, it's earthy. Cute. You know, it's, it's totally your vibe. I, I hate the these only jeans. pants you could wear. But they hurt, they're digging into me and I hate them. They they're hurt. They're cute. Now we're doing the girls' night out fun sassy outfit. And first we have Amy this time. Oh, what? Isn't that wild? It feels a little more like boho yeah. than girls' night out. I wanted to try I something know. different. I never have worn anything like yeah, this shirt. Yeah, I just don't know if I'm gonna give you a lot of points, honestly, because it feels really daytime, really casual, and really chill. <laughs> to me, this does not feel chill. What? You're like billowing in fabric. Yeah, it's, it's like, such oh. a statement to me because I've never worn a shirt that's like big and flowy. For Amy's outfit, I give her a five because I don't feel like she followed the assignment. I'm just trying to be an honest judge here. I'm trying to be a Simon, not a Paula. But overall look, I thought she looked good. It just didn't look like the right scenario for this. But I still give her an A for effort. All right, let's see Catherine's girls' night out look. <laughs> oh! Wait, okay, how does Amy have a skirt that's not way too short? For yeah, her? I don't know. Chopped. I think it was very long on her. That's my guess. But I feel like I've seen her wear that. Oh, you know what else? You're wearing it more of a normal. Um, yeah, like, and she probably lower, wore it a lot higher. Mid to lower waist, and hers yeah. is like up to her shoulder. I like this. I feel like she's going to a live stand-up comedy Girls night show. Out. So I think this works really well. I would have never known it wasn't from your closet. Wow. Even one of Amy's longest dresses like was barely, like it, I couldn't wear it. I feel like a little yourself. exposed. I don't normally wear tank tops. It's kind of weird for me. I like to cover like my, and I just, I, I, I like how I look better with my shoulders covered. I think it's more flattering. What? I don't really love it. That's shocking to me because you walk out and I was like, whoa, I think it's really flattering. I like that. I like the outfit. I just don't like the tank top. I wouldn't wear this. Final reveal. One, two, three, drop your pillows. 
Whoa, are you wearing those jeans? Look at how high up they go on me, look at that. This is like up to my How does Amy fit into all of my jeans? I told the viewers at home, skinny jeans were the only thing that I was gonna be able to do. I would give Catherine um, an eight. Wow. I was, yeah, I wasn't fancy cool. enough. I didn't realize yeah. I needed to be fancy. Look, so. everyone oh, okay. can do their own girls night out thing. I'm just going off of my vision. When I think girls so. night in, I think like sweats. When I think girls night out, I think like going out. Yeah. Now we're gonna see Catherine's fancy date night, but I'll be the judge of that. Here we go, bring her out, Kath. Everyone give her a round of applause. Whoa! Wait, that's Amy's dress? Yes, it's Amy's. Wait! I think it's a floor length dress on Amy. Like a long, like maxi dress. <laughs> what? It it's very, good. it's kind of like big, like the waist is really big. I don't really love how it fits on the top. It's a little matronly. Yeah, like, that's what I'm saying. It just feels like though. all this extra fabric. But you look fabric. like, I would say this looks like Date night, 30 years into your marriage. Yeah, I feel, I feel, it's weird because Amy's clothes feel a lot younger than what I would normally wear, but this feels like way older, older. than what I would normally, like I feel like I'm like in my 40s maybe. So here's my thoughts. She looks great. It's a little boring. It's a little plain. It's flattering. You know, I don't know that she really did anything with that dress. She just kind of put it on. I think overall she just looked good, but it was a little safe. So I'll give her a six and a half on this one. Now it's time for Amy's fancy date night. Let's it's bring her out. Fancy. Whatever. Bring her out. It's more like a nice dress. Wait, what are you talking about? This is fancy. Really? Wait, what? Amy, you have like a, like a structured, like clean skirt. Okay, the only thing that brings it down, well, besides the Don't obnoxious look at the amount of camp counselor friendship <laughs> bracelets, Here, you um, can see. the color is a little daytime of yeah. the top. The skirt's great. I can't believe that fits you. That's Catherine's skirt. What did she wear it with? Full pants, I hope. <laughs> I really like this. Your best look by far. Off Thank the you. bat, I'm gonna give you an eight or an eight and a half. I really like it. If you would have cut that garbage off your wrists. Whoa! You know, I like them. Oh, well, it would have been a nine. I eight. could have taken them off. I yeah, just you forgot. Should have them. Well, and I, I like the shoes you paired with it. It's a nice contrast. Um, yeah, you. really good stuff. Wow. Would have never known this wasn't from your wardrobe. I tried, yeah. It fits you like I a really like glove. this skirt. Dang. One, two, three. Oh my gosh, Amy! Yeah, that does not look too big at all. It looks like yeah, it fits it just well. Baggy. It just feels like it's kind of baggy. That's like, the point. I like it. It's like a, the waist, yeah. I feel like you could take it in a little. Guys, that goes to my literal ankles. <laughs> I love the shoe <laughs> pairing. Thank you. That's sick. <laughs> It doesn't wow. look like you That's don't cute. own it. See, I can't really wear that shirt because it's not long enough to wear without a cami, but I hate having like a cami wearing popping yeah. it. Yeah. I have to have like a really high skirt to wear it with that shirt. I was just gonna say, what do you wear that shirt with? How do you wear it? I just wear it with a really high skirt that like meets it. Skirt. Like I have I a know. really high waisted skirt I can wear it with. Yeah. That was, okay. That I heard Lisa first. talking smack about my outfit and saying that it was boring <laughs> and safe, but listen. <laughs> Amy doesn't have clothes that I can wear. So this was one Neither of, do you. This is one of the very few options that she had. This too. I feel very like different than I would normally feel in an outfit because all of her clothing has an air of maturity to it. It's all more <laughs> structured and more like Whew, the mine. I, what I've learned is that Amy and I both own things that don't fit us that well. Yes. Like, we both mentioned that. The first outfit, Catherine won. The second outfit, Catherine won. The third outfit, Amy won with flying colors. <laughs> so, um, Catherine won overall, but I would say that Amy did so well in the last one that it puts it more at 50-50 for me instead of like two out of three. Thank you. Um, it really, like this outfit lit up my life. I was happy to see it. But Catherine's second outfit lit up my life. I was it like, lit up my hey, life. that's a new side of her. It was cute. Her. I know, I was like, I need to get more clothes like this. Yeah, it was so like fun, you know? Yeah. You know, like Catherine has a fun personality that you don't always see because she doesn't always show it to herself. But it's there. Or the world. Hey, buddy, can you not? My final thoughts are that it was really fun seeing Amy's wardrobe. It really makes me want to go shopping and try some new looks. So yes, yours does yeah. too. Oh my gosh, I feel like you really your your sophisticated side is a good look. Let us know if you want to see any of our other sisters do this challenge, or if you want to see us switch wardrobes with our brothers, which would be a challenge. It's time for question, question of the week. week. All right, this week's question comes from Instagram. This is from Rachel Glickman 12. And she says, what is your favorite flavor of ice cream? Mine is honestly anything with the vanilla base <clears throat> and then like some fun stuff like cookie dough, caramel, like moose track vibes, but also like fruit and like chocolate vibe 
two. So you basically are saying every flavor of ice cream that you like. <laughs> yeah. But those are my favorites. It changes a lot. Okay. But always a vanilla base, never chocolate. My favorite is chocolate chip cookie dough, but I can't really eat ice cream because I'm lactose intolerant, but that's what I used to Girl. eat back in the day, so. Yikes. Make sure you click subscribe and join the Sim Fam. We are a positive community who loves to lift each other up and be there for each other. And if you feel like you don't belong anywhere else, you belong here with us in the Sim Fam. Thank you guys so much for watching and we love you so much. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. We, we love, love the Sim Fam. Fam.